Howdy, Dan Williams, Survive Outdoors, where we do wilderness medicine videos, try to help you prevent from getting injured. If you should get injured, how do you treat that? We do some gear reviews. Today, we're talking about alpha-gal syndrome, and we're going to talk about treatment specifically. So one of the mainstays of treatment is going to be prevention. Best prevention for all my outdoor men and women is going to be permethrin on your clothes. And permethrin is the one that actually kills ticks. It doesn't just ward, they actually kills the tick. So much different than DEET, dithobotolamide, or picaridin. So permethrin on your clothes will kill the tick. That's important. If you're in an area where you know there's lone star ticks or the black-legged tick like these guys, then you, the, I would definitely be using permethrin. I always have some in my vehicle, it's pretty important. So that is one of the things you can do. Now let's say it happens. Let's say you get alpha gal, you, what is the best thing you can do if you can't get to an urgent care center? Well, it's literally an allergic reaction, an emergency allergic reaction. Yes, it would be good to have an EpiPen, so that's important. Uh, antihistamines, I would double up. I would do either a diphenhydramine, Benadryl, fexofenadine, Allegra, Allegra uh, Zyrtec. I would take one of those. I would also do a Pepsid, which is a histamine 2 blocker. So I would do both of those. Um, so that's important. Do those if you break out in that rash, cool washcloth, cool showers, uh, and then I would be heading into the ER or the urgent care. If you have problems breathing, do not go to the ER urgent care. Stay put, call 911. Get them to your house ASP. They can basically take care of you en route. So severe shortness of breath combined with the rash, stay put, 911. That would be the best thing to do with alpha-gal syndrome that occurs in home or wherever you may be. And so the mainstay of the treatment is you're not treating alpha-gal, you're treating the reaction from alpha-gal syndrome. And then stay away from uh, beef, venison, lamb, pork chops. Stay away from that, become a quasi-veg, and, you know, listen to some 1960s music and chill back. All right, guys, keep your eyes on the horizon, your face to the wind. If you like this kind of stuff, subscribe. We'll see you soon. Bye.